This is Outdated, and welcome to Back Catalog, uh, a show that I play, run sporadically on Fridays, where I just play some random game in my Back Catalog. And right now we're looking at Origami Shadow Edition. Uh, warning, this game uses an office safe feature. Please do not shut down the game when you see this icon, and it's that icon. Okay, got it. Lintzworks. Two feathers. Okay. So, um, my understanding is Origami is a stealth game, and a more like traditional straight up stealth game. Not what we get a lot today where it's stealth, but if things go wrong you can kind of fight your way out of it. Think Dishonored. I mean, I love Dishonored, I'm not saying there's anything wrong with that. But traditional stealth games, you are not, like say the original Thief, you're not going to be able to fight your way out of it probably. Unless you have a massive advantage somehow. So. Um, I mean, maybe in a one-on-one -on -one situation you can get out of it, but you would be scathed for sure. Um, traditionally, like traditional stealth, it's not that way. Now, the traditional stealth also has the, you get caught, you instantly fail thing, so let's hope that doesn't happen. Okay, so we've got story mode, nightfall, skins, options, profile. Let's just do story. And let's do single player. Choose difficulty. Um, is that the difficulty right there? Is that is that it? Um, how do I choose the difficulty? Three skulls, one skull, two skulls. Let's go with two skulls. All right. Chapter one. Our going. So difficulty is there. I've already done that. Let's play. Bright lights give away your position and drain your shadow essence. Oh, okay. In other words, stay in the dark. I see in the upper right-hand corner there's my load percentage. Killing guards makes noise. Blah, blah, blah. Probably about to do a tutorial anyway. Let's see. that was pretty cool outfit though looks like something out of a like comic I don't mean because of the cell shaded style I mean just the design looks like something in like a 90s comic chapter one origami that's fast whoa Yamiko. <laughs> I'm like, uh. -huh. One who invoked you? What is your name? How do you feel? Strong silent type? I guess an origami really is a blank slate. Uh, Gobby. Sorry, am I going too fast? You are an origami. A vengeful spirit summoned through an ancient ritual. I wasn't sure it would work. Vengeful? Yes. A clan called Keiho. They, they killed my people. They took our land. They have destroyed everything. We lost the war and they raised it all. Okay, ho. I'm one of the few who survived their attacks. They imprisoned me far away in the city's temple. What you're looking at now is just a projection. I don't know how long they'll keep me for. Keep me for? Um, that's whoever wrote this. Uh, that dialect's interesting, but um, or if they'll let me live. You are my only hope, Argami. Right. What am I supposed to do? Well, suddenly I'm articulate. 
For starters, you won't get far without a weapon. Follow me. A lot of clipping with her art there. This is definitely a, um... This is definitely not a triple-A game or anything. I mean, I guess it's probably closer to a single-A. The sequel recently would probably be a double-A. Whoa. Shadow Leap. Aim at any other shadow in the environment and press right bumper to teleport there. Or to teleport to that shadow. The runes on your cape show your current essence level. If you are low on essence, you won't be able to shadow leap. Alright. I like that when I'm in shadows, I mean like, it goes black, it makes it a lot easier for me to see. Oh, and I've used some of my essence, but it's coming back slowly but surely. Oh, I lose it when I'm in the light. When I get into darkness, my essence comes back. You need shadow essence to use your abilities. Intense light sources will drain your energy, while staying in the shadows will refill it. Good to know. Run. Okay. Aim, hold. Pop right on top of that. Nice. Uh, what about this? Okay, let's try it. Made it. Perfect, come. There's something here for you. Whoa. Whoa. That is not a... Katana? The Tanta? Nice design though. Not not super over the top. I mean that little rune thing on the end is the only thing that makes it like over the top. Everything else looks pretty like just well crafted. Let's see if there's anything I can interact with. Doesn't look like it. Let's run. Let's do that. Whoop. Trying to stay in the shadows. Keiho, Army of Light. You can't even see me. Eat it. Quite a few of these guys. Whoa. Enemy perception. The amount of light around you affects how visible you are. Stay in the shadows and crouch to become less visible. Bright light sources can give away your position very quickly. Careful chaos soldiers are light adepts. Their swords are imbued with light essence. Don't even think about confronting them directly. Okay. How do I crouch? Um, none of that 
that's what I want. No. There it is. Crouch. friend oh my gosh you're right there is an assassin nearby I better tell someone trying to stealthily sneak up on this guy Okay, is that everybody? Everybody? Guess it is. Let's go. Kill. Sweet. Stay in the shadows. Okay, I really enjoy this old school stealth gameplay. I am pretty cool with that. We'll wait till he comes by the other way, then we'll sneak up behind him and take him down. Good, I'm still in the shadows. check upstairs too. Oh, I see. It was just giving me multiple ways to do that objective. Because I could have come up here and like drop killed him or whatever. Nothing of use here. Huh. Let's see what's here. A little bed roll. Okay. Nothing special. Well, hello. What's in here? That's where I came in. There's a lot of ways I could have approached this. I see. And I kind of like that. That's cool. Oh, I go to a village. 
Church of Ghosts. Still hidden. Captain Yuki's death. Captain Yuki's murder. That's what started this mess. Come on, you know this. He was ambushed in the forest, remember? Killed by an enemy assassin. It could have happened here. It could happen right now. Right where you're standing. We have to be vigilant. Now, more than ever. Yes. What was that about? I don't know. Hmm. Why am I not 100% trusting her? Okay, I'm in the shadows here. I just need a plan. I don't know if this is going to work or not. Shoot. Okay, we're going to sit right here. We're going to wait a second. Where are you going, dude? Okay, I'm in plain sight. Over here. That's what we're going to do. We're going to wait for this guy. There he is. <clears throat> then when he turns around. Hmm. The thing about stealth games, you want to take your time. Do not rush it. Whatever you do. Okay, it says I'm stealthed, so let's see. Let's hear it for the boy. Let's hear it for the aerial kill. Shoot, I'm visible. No longer visible.
he did catch sight of it. Even up here, there's just a little bit of light to work with. Crap. Okay, you are who I'm going after next, though. Okay, I'm just going to wait here, because I look like I'm quite stealthy. Second thought, maybe here. And where are you? Oh, you're a flower, a plant. Oh, here comes somebody. How close are you going to get, buddy? How close are you going to get? Apparently not very. giving me a suggestion of where to go up above that guy. If I can take that guy out from behind here. Did not see me. Perfect. Pop over here. Pop over here. Pop up here. Surprise. Is that it? Let me just check, make sure there's nobody else. Running around up here. Is there a run button? Generally in a stealth game, I mean a run button might be necessary to escape trouble, but sometimes there isn't a run button. Nope, we're good. Let's move forward. I'm actually enjoying this. It just is an old school retreat from you know what modern games are like and what the little skull there hey skull what's up all right i knew him horatio a man of infinite jest sorry hamlet reference okay now what i cleared it with an s rank sweet okay Hostile kills 12. That's 1200 points. Player spotted, and I lost 100 points for getting spotted that time, those two times. Um, picked up 120 though for no respawns and 120 for no alerts. These are some odd gamer score amounts. 19. 19? That's what you're giving me? Total score 1340. <coughs> um. I picked up the never detected seal for 120 and all threats killed for 120. If I would have gone through it with no enemies killed, I could have, you know, gotten that skill. But either way, let's continue. Killing guards makes noise. Mind your surroundings before attacking the enemy. Yeah, I think. And we're back. Alright, let me see. Do I, can I save? I'm assuming this is a checkpoint. So, um, I think this is a really good place to stop. So, I hope you enjoyed this episode of Back Catalog. If so, please like and subscribe. 
I wanted to get this episode done because I have a lot of beta test footage that um, and episodes to go after this, and I do like to alternate them. So after the last couple beta test episodes, I'll put this in, then do some, a couple more beta test episodes, then do another back catalog, and then a couple more beta test episodes. You know how it is. So um, I hope you enjoyed. If so, please like and subscribe, and I will see you next time on Back Catalog.